Hey internet, I'm Color Flority, and I'm back again with Marty here. We're Hello gonna... everyone. Good morning. We're going to do Daddy. Freddy Fish 2 now. Alright. So Freddy Fish 2 is probably, in my opinion, one of the weaker of the Humongous Entertainment games. How what would you think? I'm gonna be honest, I don't really remember liking this too much. Sorry I'm late, Freddy. But it's got the Codfish Commando Action Figure. Codfish I know, I know. I know. But, like... You might want to get closer to the microphone. I just remember this was a little bit weaker than the other games. I didn't like it Okay, as much. is my computer audio, like, louder than usual? Yeah. There's something. Okay, can you still hear the game now? No. Okay, we gotta find the fine line. Now? A little bit louder. A little bit. Perfect. Alright, because it's, it's it's hard for me to hear what you're saying right now. It is? Because of how loud the audio uh, is. Ah, okay. It's fine. We'll, we'll see how it works. We'll see how it works. Okay. So, Freddy Fish 2, you can see the graphics have slightly improved over Freddy Fish 1, and now we get Luther right from the get-go. It's supposed to... well, right from the get-go, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, harp. Freddy, did you bring everything you need for school? Of course I did, Luther. In fact, I'm ready for a great day. Oh no, is this and the I really cheesy day? Oh no. Is this the really cheesy song number? I've had my breakfast. Yep. Yeah. Duh. I've got my books. Comb my bed. Oh, that's what the group school. I've got my good my books. books. Yep. Ready for learning. No offense, I've been to school. You do not do this before going to school. Yeah, I can't hear what you're saying at all. Here. And now my microphone's in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Charming. There we go. There we go. I'll race you to school, Freddy. <coughs> Never fails. You start recording and you have to cough. Every single time. We're hiding. Ah, the guppies say the school is haunted by a ghost. I love how the teacher totally believes this. <laughs> I saw the ghost, Mrs. Croker. It's super funny to be Also, they never explain this. How can it just appear out of nowhere? That is weird. Again, I don't really remember much about this. Hey, that's my toy! It couldn't have been real. There's no such thing as Man, that is a small class. Luther and I will it's a classroom. So and it's a classroom of apparently six. Get back all the toys. Six fish? Good yes. luck, Freddy. Oh. Look, one, two, two three, three, four, four five, five six. six. I know, but like, that seems like a small class for elementary. It's A, B, C. I wonder what grade Stop! you Stop! There. What grade do you think Freddy Fish and Luther are? I'm already. Sorry. Three. Oh, right. You remember this? The blackboard? Where you can put putt putt on? Nope. <laughs> a work of art belongs in a museum. But hang on, hang on. Uh, oh, I thought for sure Fatty Bear was here somewhere. He's not? Come on. That's Big Freddy Fish. Wow, okay. <laughs> There's clearly no fan favorite in, on this chalkboard. Don't know why I'm making the check marks in um, red as opposed to green, but whatever. Just One go. go. <laughs> oh, and it's Chase there? That's yeah. awesome! I don't remember that! This is also the first Humongous Entertainment game, or I guess it's Freddy Fish 1 at alternate pads as well, but. Yeah, this one actually can change pretty drastically. Yeah, I do remember that. The question is, will we be playing this more than once? What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember I could only beat like one of the paths because I had to keep restarting till I got a really easy one. Well, let's hope we can beat this one. <laughs> I've played this game a few times. This admittedly is probably second worst Freddy Fish game out there after Freddy Fish 5, but. Still not a bad game by any means. I don't even remember if I beat Freddy Fish 5. The scissors will come in handy. <laughs> the, uh, the scissors that can't cut anything because there are no blades. Great. Safe for kids, useless for adults. Ah! Hey, Luther, that was the ghost. Yeah, what? no duh, yeah. Freddy. <laughs> hey, there was a cat mask on the wall. Hey, you. 
Stop! Yeah, in a bit. Freddy's pretty fearless. Yep. Luffy's pretty fearless too. You better look out. See, these are the brave kids that are gonna go after this ghost, as opposed to the teacher who's just gonna stay in the room. Well, she has to look out for the guppies, so that's totally understandable. Yeah, but like everybody's living in fear of this thing. She could just send the kids home. Yeah, but that would be such a weird thing to explain to the parents. Oh, we have to send. We have to send. We have to send them home. Where's the principal? Scaring the guppies is just wearing the guppies. Maybe this is one of those schools with no principal. I have never encountered a school with no principal. Well, this is like okay. This is like a schoolhouse. There's one room, like one room for teaching. At least from what it looks like. Explore one room. There are probably more. So, huh? which five things this we need? Okay. Of all the Ooh. things we need to build our trap, we'll just need to get a trident, a diver's helmet, a mock stock mibble box. How does she even know what that is? A I don't know. And a pulley for our trap to be complete. So, can you gather different items depending on? Yeah, the, the things? items can change each time. So, for okay. example, uh, looking at this. It's a list that shows what we need to build our trap. So... We'll still need. Yeah, to get I know, Freddy. A trident, I know. A Will you please just stop talking. Thank you. <laughs> um, I'm trying to think of other stuff you can uh, have to get. Uh, life preserver. Oh, that's what I was thinking. I was like, doesn't there an inner tube? Yeah. Or something? So there's the life preserver. I want to say there's more than that. Uh, not a clock. That's what Ray <laughs> wanted in the last game. Yeah. Uh, it'll come to me when we actually start exploring around a bit. Okay. So this is a room full of uh, filled with junk, but that's gonna actually come back to play into the finale of the game. I just realized like Freddy came up with the greatest plan ever in like two seconds. I can hardly wait to catch that toy napper. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I've never seen this before. <laughs> nice. Woofer just pulled boxing gloves out of literally nowhere. Why is the schoolhouse so creepy looking? I don't know. I know it's, it's to set just, the mood, but... Uh, maybe they, like, never cleaned the basement. They're like, eh, it's filthy down here, we're not gonna clean it. Magic! <laughs> Magic! <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, a picture of a human. Whoa, humans exist in this world. Well, actually, we knew that, because there are other humans in this game. You don't see them, but... Sure, let's go into the ventilation shaft. Uh, uh, what? Look at his face! Look at the robot! That? That, that thing's terrifying! That's, oh, I guess it kind of does look like a face. Like, that's its eye, that's its teeth. Yeah. Uh, I never noticed that before. I thought it was just a room filled with pipes, so... Hey! Uh, well, it just startled me all of a sudden. To build our trap! Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> it's filled with water! They're swimming in water. So is it just like a just current? pulling out the cork is definitely not going to work. Why not? Okay, there's actually like air bubbles in there, but you'd think that wouldn't matter. It's not like the room's gonna fill up with air. <laughs> that would be weird. Yeah, that's kind of a weird thing. It would be one thing if there was like steam, but the fact that it's just bubbles means, eh, it's really not that dangerous. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Today's goal, find as many random background things to click on as possible. Also, try to find a fatty bear reference, because I've yet to okay. find one in this game. You haven't? I have not. Oh man, that's gotta change. I know. I thought they were like, <laughs> pro Freddy friendly. for class president. Freddy's totally gonna win the class presidency. <laughs> That was the cat mask I was telling you about. I am scarred for life now. Thanks. <laughs> Sorry. I thought it would be okay, cute. Okay, where should we go first, Marty? Um, let's go to the right. Right? All right. Oh, yeah, it's Casey. Oh, so we do have to do this. This is what I remember. Hi, Casey. What happened? If you have to get the pulley, I then yeah. So so I actually this wear glasses. Me and <laughs> I actually wear glasses, and if you do not have glasses, this is what it's like. You just can't see it all, and you bonk well, stuff. Well, different people. Some people, it's like, well, they only need glasses to like see like 
paper in front of him or yeah. like to read books. Well, like reading glasses. Apparently, but I, he's I basically like legally shoes. blind without his glasses. You're making a Aww. spectacle of Poor yourself. fishy. Get it? <laughs> glasses? Blue for I liked that pun. <laughs> This is, that's what it's like when I tell puns. It's funny and people just stare at me. And people are just like, oh, oh come on, Artie. Boy, okay, yeah, Freddy's oh. totally trying to win that class presidency. What if every good deed Freddy does is just to try to get the class presidency? <laughs> oh, secret motives. Although Luther could be a good class president. Not really. Oh, not really. I don't think Luther sure. strikes me as the really studious type. Yeah, but he's like brave and funny and he's like away from the cave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is what I remember the most as a little kid, and I like laughed my head over. Oh my gosh, it's the duck. <laughs> oh my gosh, like half the stuff in this room is in Maze Madness in the background. It is? Yeah, that duck is in the background of the, uh... <laughs> that duck is in the background of the, uh, orange cave levels. It is? Yep. Yeah. When I do a Maze Madness Let's Play, you'll see. I'll point it out. Those are some thick glasses! It looks cute like that, though. That's a pretty awesome thing. Nice! I, okay, the animation in this game is really fluid. I really like it. Mm. <laughs> Poor Luther. I don't remember this. Uh, I do. Uh, uh, I don't remember Freddy vs. 2 having so many random musical numbers. I do. That was one of the reasons I actually didn't like it. You like musicals. I know, I'm a fan of musicals, but I'm a fan of good musicals. Aww. Okay, why is this kid not in class? Is he, like, too smart for school? Uh, I think he's, like... Oh, whoa. What if it's summer and they're just taking summer school classes? Oh, they failed! Or they're trying to get ahead. Or... Okay, or let's Casey's be honest. just all done with like all 12 grades already, and it's just like, oh my gosh, we kind of now. Seems smart. Let's do this on the worm makes. <laughs> Ow. I always wondered how it'd feel yeah. to get your head caught in a pipe. You did? Now I know. <laughs> it feels bad. Later, man. <laughs> You're just gonna leave him like that? That's gonna be the thing for every Freddy Fish game we play. I'm just gonna leave someone in, like, trouble. <laughs> that happened in the first one. Yeah, that's true. Oh, yeah. There's so this- Okay, so in Freddy Fish 1, I would ask where uh, Freddy Fish takes place. It obviously takes place sometime near Greece, because, look, it's like all this Greek architecture. Oh, yeah. Or actually, I guess so, like, that's like a that's Roman soldier up there. Mediterranean Sea. Yeah, definitely Boom. somewhere in the Mediterranean Sea. But then there's also Freddy Fish 3. Maybe it takes place in different parts of the ocean. Because, like, Freddy Fish 3 is like. Would you say it's like kind of Caribbean ish? What? Would you say Freddy Fish 3 is kind of Caribbean ish? Uh, yeah. Wow. What? Oh. I feel ripped off. That was way too easy. <laughs> We need to get four more things to make our trap. Let's play that game again. Okay. Alright. Hmm. See, this is actually a pretty tough game, all in all. I don't ever remember doing this. There we go. Yeah, that's about right. And now we're trapped. How are we gonna move that down? We, you can literally I never move that down. Don't know. Oh, well, that what? Answers that we can't move that down. Um. Hmm. 
Move that thing down. Hey, no. Uh. That's not it. What's supposed to go here? Uh, that. I hope not. I think maybe the blank spot. No, I think that's in the right place. Um. You're better at puzzles than me, so you're on your own. Well, Luke, here's my answer. <sighs> Professor Layton. Oh, come on! Oh. Is that the piece that's supposed to, like, be the last one we put in, maybe? Don't know. Man, this is weird. See, I thought it was yeah, supposed this to go... Is tough. I thought... The piece all the way on the right was supposed to go underneath the fish lady. I thought it was blocked in. Forget it. I'm, you know what? No. Yeah, that is definitely not something okay. I could have done as a little kid. Or even really now, apparently. That's a tough puzzle. <laughs> yeah, I also stunk at video games as a little kid. Putt putt reference, do you think? <laughs> yes. Okay, so sometimes if you have to find the life preserver, there will be like a fisherman with a hook right there. You have to use the scissors to cut the hook and get a worm doodle. Then you can give that to Eddie the eel and he'll give you the life preserver. Oh, okay. Bam. Eddie the eel makes a reappearance in this in case you didn't know. Alright. Where to go next? Wait, what I'm... is that on the upper what? right? What's that thing underneath the two fishes? What? This? No, that thing. That's Ray. Oh. It's just kind of creepy from where I'm sitting, because he looks like he's grinning. Alright, alright, fine. We'll go up here. Actually, you know what? No, we're not gonna go up there. We're gonna go see Ray. Yay! Everyone loves Ray. He's the Yay! old guy, kid, guy who tries to swindle people out of their old trophies. For some reason, that's never okay. explained. Okay. No, I'm serious. He seems like that shifty guy that's just like, you wanna buy a watch. What can I do? You don't wanna hang around. Hey, Ray! How's business? You probably heard that I am now a collector of fine new and used trophies. <laughs> And I'm uh, trading one of the specialty item. A Moxdock Nibblebock Whopper Bubber. A very hot item, I might add. Yeah. Okay, you know, you know whoever made that just a bit to be poke, 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 poke. We're not touching them, not touching them, not touching them. No, with this, you are touching them. way under my cost, but since you're such a swell looking That'd kid, be a really weird I'll shift. let you have it for one slightly used Just looking trophy. At that. A slightly used trophy? I think we could probably find Why, a, why a slightly used one? Well, I don't want it too used so that it's like in two pieces, you know? <laughs> yeah, but you don't want like a brand new shiny one? Oh boy, they have the movies. The movies, movies. The movies are the best part of this, let's be honest. I mean, that's what we said about the and first one. one. How can a guy make a living literally here. just selling pulleys? Mm. Is there really that much demand? Oh boy, it's Codzilla. Codzilla. Hey, it looks like the first show is about. So is it like a live thing, or is there like a movie that's gonna play? No, it's live in the first one. Okay. <laughs> wow. All right. How mature. This is gonna be great! Yeah! 
I mean, we're ditching school. We're gonna go see the movies. Godzilla. And that's it. That was a ripoff. Oh. Coming to a theater in you. Action. <laughs> Adventure. Pie? Holding. <laughs> Oh. Okay. That still looks cooler than most of the movies out there these days. Mm, you are right about that. Roma! Time for Rackba! That does look like him! <laughs> wow, that stinks. You gotta have him! Mmm, -hmm. worm doodle. Worm doodles. Worm doodle. Ew! Original. Chocolate. Sea cucumber, lemon, orange, red. Red is a flavor. That is true. Grab them, cause you gotta have them. If you guys are wondering what red tastes like, just eat a, a Twizzler or a red vine. Yeah, I just, or Swedish I don't like, fish. I don't like Twizzlers. Oh man, this is where they got the idea for Freddy Fish Four. Yep. <laughs> I am really looking forward to doing that. Freddy Fish Four is the best. In oh yeah, by far. Uh, Who made a movie off of that? These movies are like so short, it's like a ripoff. I think these are like previews, most of them. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's like Robots meets Turbo. Yeah. Never mind, that was the whole movie, they even had credits. Wow. The Krill Seekers. Now this is pod racing. <laughs> <laughs> Best one. Fish Gordon. Okay. Oh, chunklet by worm shark spear. Shark spear. That's exactly I what wish... Hamlet is like. <laughs> is Shakespeare that interesting? It's Charlie Chaplin. Uh, Shakespeare is more interesting than a guy talking to a skull and getting a pie in his face. Okay. <laughs> oh, best one. Coming soon to Color from Artist Channel. Yes! Yes! Fox. I am Who's so also excited about this. A spy. This. Is this, did they literally do this as a preview? That's so Spy good! Facts. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that one is also the best one. These are all the best, apparently. He's just playing many golf kids, don't worry. Oh, this looks promising. <laughs> the end. Wow. And we saved the whole curse of the sardine. We're already scared by this ghost. Yeah. We don't need anything else to make us scared. Yeah, me. Uh, uh. <laughs> that's that's how every right, should there. be. <laughs> and that's all she wrote. And what do you know, half the let's play's over. It's Barnacle Bob! We all know Barnacle what? Bob, even I though don't. he was never in the first game. Hi Barnacle Bob, we're here to buy a pullet. A pullet? Forgive me for looking a wee bit Got a luck too. But you said you needed a small female chicken? Luther, I think you meant to say Polly, not Pullet. Oops, silly me. Same thing, really. This Polly yeah. for sale. None of the other ones are. Nice. <laughs> sea urchins. That's my asking so price. So this is a dude who sells pulleys for a living. Yeah, big sale because nobody's buying pulleys. Hey, Man, Barnacle this guy's still living somehow. For sale? These pulleys here, I won't ever sell. 
I just keep them around so I have stories to tell. Wait a second, what do octopuses eat? Hey, Barnacle Bob. Apparently it's purple sea urchins. Oh. Okay. It's from the schooner Hesperus. Oh, it's musical numbers. Yep. The skipper had taken See, they just need to put this as an off throttle musical. To me. Break it, you buy it. What if you can't? Do you go to fish jail? Yarr. I'll bet there's a neat story behind that pulley. This pulley come down to the sea, my friend. It was one thing to have like. It was one thing to have Arg as a music number in the first one, but this is just too much. None of them are as good as Arg. That looks like Nothing will ever be as good as Arg. The Flying Dutchman's captain found true love, you see, and had no need to sail no more, so he sold me this here pulley. So? Why don't you sell it back? Hey, Barnacle Bob, tell us about that pulley. A pirate fish had this pulley. I've never seen a trend in all the songs. Until I won it fair and square in a game of underwater croquet. I can hardly hear him sing. Well, you'll hear it in the final video, don't worry. Exit, please. It's probably a good thing How I can hardly stick hear him up sing. with the trident? Yeah. Hall of Fame. Free trophy, let's grab it! And look, it's King Crab's picture on the wall. What did he do? He's king. king that doesn't mean he's in the Hall of Fame. Pearls to build this Hall of Fame. Does it? Damn. He, he donated his pearls to build the Hall of Fame. Okay, fine. That's fine. Sturgeon Sturgeon won four gold medals in the All Ocean Powerlifting Competition. Let me see Fatty Bear's picture in the Hall of Fame. Tina held her breath above water for 13 minutes. She held her breath above water. That's funny. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> What's with all this stuff that you cook on it? It smiles right at you in a really creepy smile. And this is for like three to eight. This would scar me as a child if I clicked on that. Whereas I was playing Ocarina of Time Shadow Temple when I was like younger than you were. Well, that's because um, Ocarina of Time is good. That's a fun. That's an understatement of the year. We can break it. We've got a freaking trident. Yeah, but you are not just gonna break into hey, the Hall of Fame. This fell off the back of the lot. No one would ever know it's us. You can't have security cameras it's underwater because they use like, electricity. The combination Unless you use lock, waterproof cameras. Show this card I guess. Mr. Triple Fin. That Mr. Triple, triple Fin. So Besides, wouldn't it be like obvious if you're swimming back to the school and you're holding a giant trophy from, from the Hall of Fame? I know. <sighs> That was a yawn, by the way. Alright. Well, Freddy and Luther have goofed off at the movies for a very long time. I can't believe their teacher hasn't, like, looked for them. Ray? The give me your box stock move up off or I'm gonna run you through with this harpoon. <laughs> I don't have a sandwich to give people in this one, so I have to do something. You could give them the scissors they can't cut. I want to give them a sandwich, though. <laughs> But it was Grandma Gruber's last peanut butter and jellyfish sandwich, as in, like, last in existence. She could make another. Probably. Man, that starfish has got You the know moves. what song was playing? No. The fatty bear music from Balloonorama. Ah! Uh, ah, uh, man, so many good references. Okay, but he apparently is a one-trick crab. Yeah. Don't hire him to dance. You do have to click on these in this specific order, because Freddy and Frank apparently can't jump over that sail. Sand barge. Great! We made it to the other side! So now Great what lip -sync ocean are they in? Fish. I'm still in the Mediterranean Sea. It's so weird! <laughs> Hey, dude, we're just breaking into your house. No need to be alarmed. What do you mean? You can hardly even see over his hairy eyebrows anyway. Do you have the combination to the trophy case lock? Well, dip me in gravy and call me a biscuit. You bet I do. Uh, may we have the combination? It depends. Oh, nice. I've seen lots of locks in my time. 
You'll have to get me a business card with a locked serial number. All right, fine. You don't want any oh, finny business. What's this? <laughs> hey, you giving me the business? <laughs> Your business card, sir. Well, so it is. <laughs> you boys will be wanting the accommodation to the trophy case. Excuse me, sir, but I'm not a boy. I'm a girl. See? Hey, uh -huh. that's a coincidence. So's Mrs. Triple Finn. Thanks for the combination, Mr. Triple Finn. You know what we need? An ever music number. Another one? What a cow got <sighs> He had a fine young seahorse <laughs> by the name of Sand Dollar. He'd ride into town with his ten gallon hat. Just wait till we get to Papa and enter the race. Name. We've got the guy proceeding all the vegetables. Back. I like the root to Vegas. And a <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm looking forward to Papa and enter the race. But I what the heck? Ooh, forgot about that. I haven't played it in years because normally when I play it on the computer, it doesn't work. They were playing the Count Barracuda music from the movie. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's having fun sli like s <laughs> sliding down that oil drum. Nice. So I know in Freddy Fish 1 there was that whole like throw the jellyfish minigame you never knew about. Yeah. Did you know about uh, this minigame by any chance? I guess I'll know in a moment. We're with rest to spit. Um. Uh, give me a sec. This looks like a fun game. Don't let him. He has to fail. spit. I'm the greatest shot in the world. Yeah. Okay. Nope! I do not remember this at all! Really? Nope! Apparently not. Because I think I would have, like, just died over this as a kid. You would have what? I think I just would have died over this as a kid. Cool. Well, yeah. Uh, you can play that game as much as you want. I don't think it has an end. I'm not doing a let's play of that one. Good. Also, this might be the coolest part of the game. To get the purple sea urchin up there, you gotta shoot it down. Woohoo! A purple sea urchin! Would you Here, do the honors? Why don't you try your slingshot? What do I do? Great idea! You literally just move I'm it on the purple sea urchin, wait for the lock on, game. and then push click. Okay! Alright, let me take a look. Lock! Woohoo! <laughs> Got it! I was shooting with those things. With a slingshot will be easier than that. Well, yeah. Theirs is extremely accurate. I try s shooting stuff with a slingshot. It does not work very well. If you do not know what you're doing. I love the root to Bega <laughs> <laughs> No you one wants to watch that. Okay, you really... I don't remember that. Well, you probably never clicked on his accordion then. Nope. I was just kind of going to play the game. I didn't really click on stuff much as a kid. Neither did I. Because it either like creeped me out. Yeah. How many fish are just gonna smile at us? It's creepy. Yeah. Like I said, it either will like creep me out, or I'm like, I gotta beat the game. Why is there a scarecrow underwater? I don't know. It's probably best not to That's question. Sea urchin over here, Luther. You need all five sea urchins. Five. This diving helmet will be great. Is there any uh, Freddy crap. Fish game where you need to have more than five? Um, no, I don't think so. Hey, Luther, how about giving and me a In Freddy Fish 3, you get orange sea urchins. I really sandwiches. appreciate the great mm -hmm. job you're doing. Oh. <laughs> no, Luther, <laughs> this helmet See, is I haven't played the Freddy Fish games in a long help time. Help me break it loose. Oops. <laughs> Silly me. <laughs> Whew. How are we going to get the helmet for our trap? I'm sure there's a way. We just have to think of it. Try cutting the weeds with the scissors. Okay. If anything, you'd want to cut it with the trident, because it's actually sharp. These scissors have no blade. It's literally just like plastic on. Okay. Let's just shoot. I want to shoot it off. That would be really fun. But yeah, the scissors are the thing you have to use. No. Oh. I was right! For yeah, one. there's no blade at all. Safety first. Not to mention he's using them underwater, which would make them even worse. Yeah. I haven't tried cutting anything with scissors underwater, so I wouldn't know. I hope not. <laughs> Look, it's a purple sea urchin, Luther. 
Are you ready for even more musical number? Oh no! How many it's are there? It's time for Eddie the Eel to sing a song. What? Hi, Eddie. Eddie the Eagle too? I think the whole the ocean is getting infected with this singing with disease. Not that I can play. Never really gets that hot. I this is like Oscar the Grouch singing. He even kind of sounds like Oscar a little bit. Thankfully, he's not actually trying to eat us in this. Good. You're a big lip fish. I think he had enough after the sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> They always just look right at- Oh! And the rope! That's right. Sometimes you need a rope. In that case, there's a book in, like, the basement of the school that you can use to basically learn how to untie the rope right there. Ahoy, oh. Captain Schnitzel! How's the submarine? Going nowhere fast! <laughs> but that's okay! It gives me time to zing my Z this is! Are you kidding? The exception to this rule I've never seen yet. If you jump in the ocean, you're bound to get wet. Oh, I know what I'm using this, the uh. I know what it's gonna be the thumbnail for my video. <laughs> oil, that'll come in handy. Oh, also a wheel. You're gonna have to get a, like a buggy wheel. There's a wrench in that pipe room, uh, in that. that case, and you can use the wrench on the wheel in here. So how do you like it? I call it the wet look. <laughs> Just toss the oil over here. Hey. Oh, come on, pop pot in fish form. Hey. Hey. And Freddy Fish is apparently living in there. It's the trident, so okay. going to Man, they just do not want me to impale anybody with that, apparently. <laughs> Go figure! It's almost like this is a kid's game. Are useless. <laughs> I think it's just their bodies look like clothes. Didn't we think that's what Mrs. Halibut was? Yeah. King Krabs Castle. Alright, let's get this trophy. I bet we can get this lock open now. Who would? Work. Ray. All right. We're actually thieves. I remember how proud I was when I won this trophy. Gee, it looks expensive. So Freddy won the spelling bee, apparently. All for the class presidency, of no, course. No, Luther. The trophy isn't gold. Only the memories that go along with it. Wow, Freddy. It's the trophy I won. Hey, spoiler alert, you can't say that. We're gonna have to cut that out in editing now. <laughs> Barnacle Bob, got any uh, deals today? Here. Here's one here to my Can I just give them all five? I've got five. Here's two sea urchins, Barnacle Bob. <laughs> Let's go, boy, dinner tonight. Here's three sea urchins, Barnacle Bob. Here's two sea urchins, pickets. Barnacle Bob. Ouch. This is the last sea urchin we have. Especially since he's only selling one, apparently. Thanks a lot, Barnacle Bob. He's like, you're the Thanks first person to buy some. I need yeah. or even expecting. Just keep up your interest in pulley collecting. Oh, he's selling to pulley collectors, apparently. Yeah! Oh, oh. Ten bucks says. A mock stock, middle bock, wapa bapa under my wing. It's an advertisement for his own product! Makes me want to swim around and sing. 
<laughs> this game just has so many musical numbers that they just pull out of nowhere. Ray, you won't yes. believe it, but I just happen to have a slightly used trophy. <laughs> He's like, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Freddy Fish, when at the spelling bee, mm, this is me, all right. Quality. <laughs> Kid, you just made the deal of the century. And now... Gee, Freddy, sorry you had to give up your spelling bee trophy. I know how much that trophy yeah. meant to you. It's okay, Luther. I remember how special it was to win it. And that's what really matters. Like I said, this is all just publicity for a class presidency. I want to hear her, uh... Oh yeah! I totally forgot about this scene. <laughs> yes, Gwen Father, we know you never had a toy in your whole life, but... But we can't get you any until the kids are out of the classroom. <laughs> <laughs> well, the kids haven't left yet because of that Freddy Fish. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's gonna be yes, thumbnail. <laughs> no more excuses. We'll do what we gotta do. <laughs> uh, boss, uh, just what do we gotta do, huh? We gotta get rid of those kids. Gee, wonder who did it. <laughs> All right, only one thing left to do. We gotta get that pipe off of Tucker's head. That's funny. I was gonna say Freddy Fish's music is kind of one of the weaker music. That for pipe looks like it's stuck on Tucker. Journal. It's very atmospheric. I would say that. But it's not like the kind of music where I'm like, you know what I'm in the mood to listen to? Freddy Fish music. One of the darker Lord, moments Tucker. in Young Sir Terrence's life. Because he sure doesn't have one now. <laughs> sure I do. It was just stuck in my shell. Whew. Are we? That's good. Not we were no afraid we committed kids. murder for a second Thanks there. You did. <laughs> hey, dude. Uh. It's the muck stuck nope. nibble box whopper. It wouldn't be nice to hit somebody <laughs> with our slingshot. These are my plastic coated feet. It's the pits and hole. It's the trident. All right, fine. We get it. You're gonna be a wimp and you're not gonna use the switch. Hey, Casey, you wanna test this out? Careful, or we'll poke someone's eye out. <laughs> well, we can't poke his eyes out because his glasses are there. <laughs> Vote Freddy. <laughs> the class prez. She doesn't want to look deaf to <laughs> Spoiler alert for my next Ewok Sweater Table Let's Play. <laughs> and, and spoiler alert for the next Putt Putt game in the series. Yeah! No, it's not race next. Give me this is a stick up. This is a stick up. Careful, or we'll poke someone's eye out. It wouldn't be nice to hit somebody oh, with a slingshot. Take this over. Do you think that's really a dress? Do you think that's like? Oh, okay. Oh, and you can print out your masterpieces. I totally forgot about that. Are there capital letters? Nope. Yes, Freddy, I'm well versed oh. in the alphabet by now. M. R. V. O. T. E. F. O. 
儿。Shame with self promotion aside, we really should end the game now. <laughs> I will say the ending scene's pretty cool in this. Oh, wait, no, we still need the cork. In the pipe room? Alright. <laughs> I have so many thumbnail options! This pipe would fit great where that cork is! I don't know, Freddy. It looks kinda small! <laughs> oh, what if it's toxic gas in there? It works! That might explain. I told you it would fit! <laughs> Let's go catch that hole! That's right, now it automatically goes to catch the ghost. We're ready to make our trap, Luther! Sponge, mop, stop, it will bop, walk, the bopper, helmet, trident, the pulley, the rope we never That's saw. Just about we everything. also never saw the life preserver or Luther, the wheel. Luther, can we use your toy as bait? Well, okay. <laughs> Our trap is complete! Someone's coming! Freddy's pretty diabolical. <laughs> hey, boss! Look! A toy! Let's grab it! Now, Luther! <laughs> They're just mesmerized with their Whoa, this is pretty cool. <laughs> Wouldn't it be amazing if it was Grandma Groot under that disguise? It's almost like it has two heads. <gasps> Biggest plot twist since Mega Man 6, and look at that! It's Fatty Bear! <laughs> The squid father told us to, cause he's never had any. How old is the squid father? You know that you can't just take things. He's a father, apparently. Uh, duh. you know, she just might have a point there, boy. Okay, you can give back the toys. The squid father doesn't need the toys as much as the copies. Yeah, it's true. Here, give this to the squid father. He should have at least one toy. Aw, oh, that's nice of him. Apparently the squid father lives in the basement. Because <laughs> that's where they swam off to. Look what we found! Here come the guppy toys! Yay, Freddy for pressing that! We found the mystery, Mrs. Croker! Mrs. Croker? There wasn't really a ghost haunting the school. It was just those sharks pretending to be a ghost. <laughs> Honestly, the sharks are more in intimidating than the ghost. Saved the school. Really? Did they? <laughs> Did they really save the whole school? They made the guppies feel better, and they recovered stolen property, but they it's not like the school was gonna go under. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, because like the case of the haunted schoolhouse. Yeah, there's a ghost going around, but it's the schoolhouse itself, Ruyo. Really More musical numbers. Freddy Fish 3 and 4 have the best credits. In the Humox Entertainment series, that is. What the heck? Yeah. That's a saw shark. Is it?
<laughs> yep, that is Freddy Fish 2, and wow, the song is still going. Alright. Hope you enjoyed this episode. I'm Color Forty, and I will see you for the next Humongous Entertainment Let's Play. See you later, everyone. Have a great day, and God bless. Are you sure you want to stop playing? Bye-bye!